In this video, we'll discuss the test done to check for median nerve palsy. The two tests are clasping test and OK test or OK sign. The patient cannot make O sign with thumb and index. So what's the O sign or OK sign? Normally, when thumb and the index finger, they meet each other, they flex. This is the O sign and this sign is a normal sign. And But this sign is negative in anterior interosseous nerve injury. So the patient is unable to touch the tips of the thumb and index finger. So what muscles are paralyzed in this condition? Flexor pollicis longus and flexor digitorum profundus. Because in O sign, both the interphalangeal joints of the thumb and index finger are flex. Flexor pollicis longer flexes the thumb and flexor digitorum profundus flexes the index finger interphalangeal joint. And instead of flexion at this interphalangeal joint, these joints become extended, pinched. Clasping test. Clasping test is positive in median nerve injury above the cubital fossa or elbow. So what happens in clasping test? When patient claps hand, the index and middle finger interphalangeal joint and terminal phalanx of the thumb are unable to flex. Why? Due to lesions of the anterior interosseous nerve. So why there is loss of flexion of index and middle finger? It's due to the paralysis of flexor digitorum superficialis and lateral half of flexor digitorum profundus. And why there is loss of flexion of distal phalanx of thumb? It's due to paralysis of flexor pollicis longus.